This is just a quick video on how you would add your DKIM, that's DKIM, and SPF settings that you'll get from Moosend to your domain. So basically how it works, and it works like this for all uh, of the big email senders like Amazon SES works the same way. You have uh, two settings that you're going to get from the platform that you want to put into your um, DNS settings. So in plain English, basically if you have a control panel and you open it up and you're looking at it, what you're going to want to look for is in your domain section something that says DNS editor. Yours may or may not look like this. It may look a little bit different. What we're going to do is open it up and then we're going to add just two records. So um, some of the older versions that actually when you open it up you'll see a whole bunch of records and um, don't be confused by those because those are, are basically irrelevant for what we're going to do here. All we're going to do is add two new records. So with my control panel, for example, I would have to open this up. And then I would have to add two text records. So you see here it says add. I would go down and I would look for a text record. That's it. So I can either add it here. Um, I can click on existing text records and look at what I have from there. There's different ways to do it. Here you see an SPF record here, um, and the name is my domain name with a period after it. So uh, basically you just click on add a new text record, and then you get the name, and you get the record from Moosend. It'll give you both, one for the DKIM and one for the SPF settings. So you cut and paste the information in these two sections here, and then you just click on add records, and that'll save it. You do it twice, one for each, and then you can verify it. Um, right here in your control panel. I would show you how to do it, but um, once you verify it, it seems like that disappears so you don't have to do it again. So uh, that's it. I hope that gives you a little more, um, hope it's helpful. Maybe gives you insight on, on how to access um, your DNS records and how simple it is to paste it in there. All right, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.